guys, you may be asking yourself, Jay, what are what am I looking at? What's this? What's going on right now? Well, apparently, this is your king and your queen, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I'm sorry, your kang and your queen. Okay. There is so much here to parse. It really is. And a big part of the reason why I'm not even playing the audio to this is because the chick only has one, um, says one thing, and that's shut up to the guy. And, well, <clears throat> I'm just curious as to which one of them uploaded this, okay? Something tells me the woman. Something tells me this was her entire idea. But the worst part is, is that he went along with this. Like, that's it. And then, okay, yeah, check this out. Because she just she just sat there and showed literally the only thing worth a damn that she has. It's a fat booty. I mean, if you look at the chick all together, right? Bruh, she is like, sweetheart, 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 sweetheart. What the heck is the point of having a fat booty when you got a gun? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, a fat booty, nice. But that gun is where old boy right here is about to run into a few problems particularly down the road I mean, yeah she's sitting there babying them now and with the way that you know we got so many different processed foods and jacked up um you know hormones and stuff like that in our food it's really hard to tell um how old these guys are but it seems like they're a rather young couple and so it ain't nothing but trouble ahead bro ain't nothing but trouble ahead but he's sitting here eating like a, he feels as if he's eating like a king off of a paper plate with a uh, with a with a baby with a baby bottle and you're wearing a bib my guy <laughs> you should be ultimately like okay so here's the deal because hey i've been in relationships i've had fun in the relationships none of my exes would have ever dared try like yo if you go on like you know cater to me whatnot what have you is going to be on some like legit shit i'm not you don't cater to a man on paper plates can you think, like, like this isn't catering this is a hot dog truck okay <laughs> but either way yo it's a little ridiculous um you know what people put, like you know hashtag relationship goals seriously this is I, i'm watching um i'm reading the comments to these uh to this type of content you know the chicks are just having the laugh of their life and sweetheart those titties look terrible all right <laughs> like, can i keep it a buck like yo like you you are clearly someone's mother all right but you say here, like, you know, pretending, like, because this is all that, you know, it's really worth. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, it's like, like food stamps and, a, and, and, and something to smash, which guess what is going to eventually turn on you because women are hypergamous by nature. All right. So, I mean, like, bro, bro, look, whatever little weird thing you and your lady do it's always best to be kept amongst y'all because i get the comedy make absolutely no mistake about it i completely understand how this is a comedic situation you got the juxtaposition of this uh you know tough thuggish looking i'm not gonna call him a thug i'm just saying he's thuggish looking thuggish looking this tough thuggish looking man with the with the face tattoo and everything else like that wearing a bib and being fed by his quine and the deal is <laughs> like yo like on paper plates so in, in, in a very seemingly open um situation there it's like yo like it, it, struggle love man struggle love and you know there's a, a, a part of me that appreciates this right but there's another part of me that as a man that sees this and knows i would want absolutely nothing to do with anything like this I I mean that's one of the well, that's one of the more challenging parts of American black culture is that they, like when people when this is what you know when this is the environment that you come up in and the, and and you've been given no better examples then you know yeah settle for that struggle love man 
Like, seriously, I mean, it, like, I, you know what? Say what you will. At least it seems somewhat genuine, right? Like, she really, she's really into the dude. And she really care about the dude until, you know, the hypergamy kick in or he get locked up or, you know, however, whatever the uh, ultimate end game, which is cliche as hell for this club will be, uh, takes place. You know, I mean, power to him. This is a moment. Get to enjoy yourselves. It's just very, very telling how instead of, you know, being on some king shit, you know, like, oh, I got you a crown and I'm and I made you a steak and some potatoes and shit like that. And I'll feed it to you, but I'll feed it to you on a fork and, you know, be real feminine. Because hold on. Listen to this chick right quick, because that's another thing I want to talk about. Listen to this chick. I mean, pump up the volume because. I don't play for real. Shut up. That's her line. Shut up. <laughs> but you hear how 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 still masculine it is. How how she still uh, has uh, the energy of a male, or she's trying to, or or she is. It's really hard for him to turn off because of the you know, like I can't speak to either one of their upbringings, except for what I'm witnessing right here. And oh. <laughs> You know, she's, she's rather pleased. She's, she's showing you ladies out there how to treat your man. And honestly, if he had a father, he'd know exactly how disrespectful this shit is. I wish, I wish, I wish my, like any lady that I ever dealt with would even consider, oh yeah, I'm going to put a bib on you and you know, I'll feed you like, like, no, no, you can feed me grapes, you know what I'm saying? Cause that's, that, that's opulence, you know, you, you laying across, uh, you laying across a nice little bench and, and, and she's sitting there just feeding you grapes or some other type of fruit that that's opulence. This right here is just, it's just hood trash, man. But it's 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 quote unquote the culture, right? This is this 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 is the life. This is the struggle life. The one that you know, not just about me, but for you know my offspring and much something I I personally would never want for myself. But hey, to each his own. So guys, with that being said, we're gonna bring this one to an end. All the internet stuff. If you like this, toss the like, dislike, go ahead, do that too. Don't be scared of you. Sub if you jump a fantastic voice, you might get videos like this every single day. Share because sharing is caring and YouTube and bitch you and like on the biggest fans of your boy over here for very obvious reasons. Bang the bell for notifications. Get something from the Teespring. Check me out on Patreon as well. Links in the description and speak. Let me know what do you guys think in the comments. Those are some saggy ass titties, bro. <laughs> Like, like they really like they really are and you guys already know how i feel like that like she is just walking talking like red flags you know like yo she don't really take care of herself uh and hopefully you know like i'm hopefully you know the the whole thuggish persona is just a show and you know my, my dude's on point maybe he codes you know, maybe maybe he he about to like just like make hit a hit a real good lick and about to come up. Fingers crossed for you, bro. Seriously, but this right here, this right here is not a good look by any stretch of the imagination, and it really goes to show how women, how American women, and particularly American black women, view American black men like fucking children, like they are babies. Oh, I gotta take care of you. And if you're familiar at all with um the Willie Lynch letters, because I've seen Joe Brown, Judge Joe Brown going nuts about the Willie Lynch, Lynch letters recently, but yeah, the connection between, you know, mother and son and that, that like, I guess the Oedipus complex within, um, <laughs> within black, black American, I don't know his lineage, but yeah, I, one would assume that you're here in the States, buddy. So, um, you know, the, the, or just Western society in general, the, the, the Oedipus complex between Western men and the woman is bananas. But you may disagree. And that's what my comment section's for. Until the next one, guys.